Terms just days away now, San Diego homeowners are coming together to hold a rally against Measure B, which would allow the city to charge a fee for city provided waste management services and here to share more on tonight's rally and why he's opposed to measure B is chairman of reform California Carl DeMaio boy Carl this uh, people's ordinance as it's called the century old law that uh, kept people from paying for the service is uh, getting quite a lot of people talking about this garbage tax good morning good morning Lauren but I do want to correct we already are paying for garbage that's, uh, and that's, do not do not get suckered in by the politicians talking points the people's ordinance allocated and earmarked an existing property tax fund for solid waste management garbage collection so when people say we're getting it for free that's not true we've been paying for it the politicians now want to charge us twice that's the reality yeah, and, and that's sort of been the rub. There's also been this talk of, of fairness. People who are in support of this say, oh, it's it's about equity, it's about fairness, because some people in, um, in different living situations, in the condos and apartments, pay a separate fee. What is your argument to, to the equity side of this? Well, let's see why those uh, apartments and condos have to pay that fee. What happened was the politicians in the 1990s uh, got lawyers because they always are looking for ways to look, you know, to get more money from us. They got lawyers to look at the people's ordinance from 1919, 1981, 1986, the three times we voted on this. And, and they said, well, it says single family homes get uh, this uh, 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 trash service in exchange for the existing property tax revenues, but not apartments since it didn't specify apartments we can charge them so what the politicians did is they started having the apartments pay for the service so if if the politicians are concerned about equity then maybe they can repeal their own uh unequal policy that they imposed in the 1990s again these people people at the city hall on this measure and on a lot of other things, they're liars, cheats, and thieves. There's just no way to sugarcoat it. Every word out of their mouth has been a lie, and they just want more of our money. Uh, that That's the end game for them, and they will come up with any sort of excuse and any sort of narrative uh, to, um, to advance that cause. Now, the San Diego City Council President, John Elo Rivera, who co-sponsored this, this uh, measure, has said that in order to expand recycling services and some of the things that the city is in need of, uh, we have to generate funds, and that means we, which San Diego apparently is one of the only cities that doesn't have this separate trash fee uh, need to have in order to to provide the funding for those services what do you what do you say manage your money better uh, absolutely and remember this is the same sean elo rivera that continues to give salary hikes and pension spikes to city employees he's the same guy along with his other cohorts at city hall that invalidated proposition b from 2012 that saved taxpayers hundreds of millions of dollars a year through common sense pension reform. Uh, this is the same guy who says we should uh, have money from taxpayers to go to illegal immigrants. Uh, the list goes on and on at, of wasteful spending at City Hall. So how dare he, how dare he say, well, we're not gonna give you the quality of services that you deserve and that you've already paid for unless you give us more money. Uh, we need to reject Measure B. And let me also point out that the mailers, the city politicians are sending out on Measure B, absolutely de 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 deceptive. They sent out a mailer saying, B for bins, free bins. And it says that if you vote for Measure B, that you'll get a free trash bin at no charge to you. And they highlight the words, no charge to you and Measure B, so you think it's free. No, Measure B costs the average homeowner $700 a year in higher tax assessments. And that's at a time when people are struggling for inflation. So uh, with inflation, we say no on measure B. Lauren, we also have other ballot measures that we have similar concerns about all throughout San Diego County, which is why we have our plain English guide available online at San Diego election guide.org San Diego election guide.org because measure B is not the only tax hike on the ballot this year. 
Yeah, I mean, I think that's why we've heard from even a lot of Democrats on, you know, on the ballot as we've had a lot of candidates come in here ahead of the midterms. We've had uh, people on both sides of the aisle say that they're opposed uh, to Measure B. So uh, if they want, they can go to San Diego Election Guide for your um, advice on some of these measures. And tonight's rally, people can join. Absolutely. And we're serving free beer and barbecue. Uh, it's part of our series of events all throughout San Diego County to educate voters on what's really on the ballot, hear from candidates, and rally the troops. All right. Carl DeMaio, as always, appreciate the time. Thank you. Thanks, Lauren.